listen. Let's just be for real. Okay? Mm -hmm. Yeah. You know it wasn't for me. Let's start this video now. There's nothing like chilling with my girls. Just me and my divas taking over the world. What's up, Zivas and Zivos? You already know who it is. It's your girl. So this video is, of course, the things that I get in the mail and what I review. So, of course, you guys already know this is all my honest reviews, how I feel about the product. Some of them may have purchased. Some of them may have been sentiment. But either way, I'm going to tell you what I do or don't like about it, and it is what it is. So first of all, let's just start off with, no, let's just start off with this. So, you know, I was trying to be a little bit more feminine today. I mean, like, I'm always feminine, but, you know, I don't really do my nails. I don't really do the whole nail thing. I'm not with all that nail maintenance like some of y'all might be. Let me fix this ponytail. Looks like, come on now. That's kind of cute, too. Okay, hold up now. Okay, we're just going to leave it like this, honeys. What y'all think? I don't know. Hmm. It's like my good side right here. So, so, what was I talking about? Oh, yes. Okay. So, <clears throat> so I thought I would repolish the nails that I, you know, my own nails. I'm letting them grow out and stuff, you know. And I had some nail polish remover. I do. I still have it. I don't even know how to use it because I don't do my nails. So, I'm wondering, I'm thinking, does the stuff go bad? Because, um, yeah, it's cheap, but. <laughs> Listen, I know nail polish takes a minute to take off, but you don't have to scrub it off, right? It would not come off. And then, does nail polish remove it smell like um, vinegar? I'm trying to figure out, does somebody in this household use my nail polish remover for something else and put some vinegar in it just to, to dilute it? I don't, I don't even know, but I had to paint over something else. And it's all thick in certain spots. It just looks a mess. So, you guys... It, if you see like any type of, you know, incorrections, just keep it to yourself. Okay. Yes. So let's get on with this review. So you guys know, know, know how much I love Octoly.com. If you guys are doing YouTube videos, if you review products on YouTube or on social media, if you have a channel and you want to review some really cool products, then you'll definitely have to click the link below, which is Octoly. And they have like an amazing free store of items that you'll absolutely love. Plus, you will get these items gifted to you or you will receive them gifted to you. And in exchange for these gifts, all you have to do is what I'm doing right now. Yes, I know, look cute too, but you have to review them and give your honest opinion. So, of course, you know, I do love getting stuff in the mail. I think it's amazing. I'm like a kid on Christmas, opening up some packages. Even if I know what it is, I'm happy about that. So, I did get some really cool items from Oxley. And I did feature one of them in, like, my Real Talk and also my upcoming um, makeup look video using all Shop Miss A products except for my foundation. Um, which are a dollar because they have some really new amazing products out too. So the item that I did feature in my um, Real Talk along with that, um, along with my, gosh, I'm losing my mind, um, with my upcoming full face makeup tutorial using Shop Miss A's first impressions and makeup look was this right here. So I know you guys are like, girl, it's in a box. Okay, but I just had to show you the box first because I thought the box was really like sleek looking and I like the box. Um, now, I don't have a lot of boxes in my house. I'm going to throw the box out, okay? So this is the Oceanic Gold. And lately, I have been lacking in the sleeping department, meaning I've been up to like 3 or 4 in the morning, working, editing tutorials, editing videos, just working, making wigs and such. And so I haven't been getting any sleep in like 
for like a month now. So I mean, I'm, I get sleep, but it's like three or four hours a day, which is not really that great for me. And it's starting to wear underneath my eyes, which is really not that great. So I have been using this right here, which is the Honey Skin Care by Oceanic Gold Manuka. And this is their Mineral Replenishing Eye Cream. This is a nice product, okay? Now when I say nice, meaning it's a nice product, I can't say amazing or great or wonderful. I will say it's a nice product because I have been using this for about two weeks and I have seen a little bit of improvement okay so that's one now the eye that really is like the most darkest on my face is the left eye which really is like my problem area I'm always like oh my god and I can see it when I'm doing like tutorials and I'm editing my video I can definitely see it so I know you guys can too okay um, and it looks a little bit puffy underneath the eye too you just do it twice a day, morning and night, okay? But the reason why I say it's nice is because I'm seeing a little bit of improvement. If it was gone, like my dark circle, my puffiness was gone completely, then I would be like, girl, you best to go out and get you some. However, I also have to participate in this, you know, correction area, which means I need to drink more water and get more sleep. And I am trying my best with the getting more sleep area, but you know, it's hard being at it sometimes. You know what I'm saying? So I do have to pick up the slack for just a lot of things in general. So that is the reason why I lack in sleep. Um, and plus, I like to be on Amazon too. So, you know, I do like to look at Amazon. The one thing that I do like about this cream though is, you guys know how much I'm always complaining about my greasy face, you know, oily skin. And it is oily. Regardless of what you guys may think, it's very oily. You may see me doing a video and like if I'm outside or whatever later on in the half a day, my skin is like eating away at the foundation. Like, girl, bye. you did not do your face, did you? So that is how, it, you know, I have very oily skin. But this is the one thing that I like about this product. It does not like break down my concealer that I have to use or, or my foundation. It's not oily. It doesn't leave oily, greasy look on your face, which is great because I really don't like that look. Um, but it doesn't break down like my makeup under here, which is great because I don't want to look greasy and I darn sure do not want to have like, you know, concealer lines and cake face under eye you know what I mean you have oily skin and you're lacking in the sleep department and you have dark circles or anything or fine lines under your eyes right here you can definitely give this a try so far like I said I've seen a little bit of improvement but I do like the cream and it does help and the one thing that I like the most about it is girl it ain't greasy I forgot to mention this was gifted to me from oxley.com so make sure you check out oxley now on to amazon y'all listen honey a girl be on Amazon like, what? I mean, like, listen, let's just talk about this real quick. If you can get your products without leaving the house, then that's great, okay? You don't got to waste no gas money or nothing like that. You ain't got to run into people that you really don't want to see, okay? And pretend like, girl, how you been doing? You don't have to do none of that. Normally when I see somebody that I really don't want to see, I see them coming and then I'll pick up my phone. Oh, hey, yeah. Oh, and then I see them. So that's why I like Amazon a lot because I don't have to leave the house and it comes in two days. And if you have Prime, then you are getting free shipping, hunties, and you're getting it fast. So a girl like me is always on Amazon. So I make it my business every night. I will get on Amazon and look through there. I might not be buying something all the time, but it's just an adventure for me. And it's a dirty habit that I have. Of course, I did buy quite a few things this week from Amazon, which I truly did need. You know what I mean? And these are just some of the things like a girl loves eyelashes. But I, and I love eyelashes, so I love them. So I did need to go on Amazon, but I did need some more eyebrow makeup, which I have showed you guys before in the past. Um, and for those of you who have, was not able to see the video, this is the um, actual product that I use. And I get this from Amazon. It's $5.99, okay? And it's by a company called Music Flower. 24 hours of long wear wear gel eyeliner so you can use it for eyebrows so it does actually sit on your eyebrows for like 24 hours however if you have oily skin honeys you might wake up with them looking a little greasy i did do a test of, of it um about two weeks ago on myself just because i wanted to see if it really really was going to work because my daughter tati does it and it works for her but we don't have the same skin type 
it did work for me. However, like I said, I have oily skin. So when I woke up, they were a little, they looked a little greasy. So, I mean, I could have worn them like that and went outside like, hey, but I really don't like like that oil sleek look. Like, you know what I'm saying? So I just redid them. You can use it for eyebrows or eyeliner. I don't use it for eye eyeliner because I just don't, but you get a dual set. You'll get two brushes, of course, um, which is nice. You get a smudge brush and an eyeliner brush, which are kind of like garbage to me because I don't use these little tiny things. If you can use these, then bless your souls, but I don't use them. Two colors, black and brown. I do use them both at one time. So I use the dark brown. I use the dark brown. And let me tell you, this is kind of like wet creamy because it will need to dry. So it's nothing that you have to like work with really quick. But once it's set and you're done and you leave it alone for some time, it will definitely stick on for 24 hours. I mean, you can definitely wash it off and you can rub it off too, but if you're not into doing any of that, then it's not gonna come off. It's waterproof, so it's really great. So this is the dark brown, this is the black. So I use both, first I use the dark brown and then I use the black. This black hasn't been used yet because I already had one. So I'll do it in brown very lightly and then I'll go over it with black, but I won't go over it entirely with the black. I'll do like the outline and a little bit of strokes and then that's it. So that's probably the reason why mine is so jet black or dark black but I love these these are really good for $5.99 you cannot beat that um, on Amazon they do have prime with it so if you have prime you'll definitely get free shipping it does have like a lot of really good reviews those of you guys who like to do your eyebrows with like eyebrow gel and stuff then this is like a really good brand now on to the lashes now I love eyelashes these ones I actually found on Amazon and these are the three fashion eyelashes three glam volume and sexy I ended up getting these for $2.99 only because it was like if you add something you have like a certain amount of products in your shopping cart for like $25 you can get another product for super duper cheap that's if you are a prime member so I seen these and I thought these were so freaking pretty so I thought these were absolutely gorgeous okay so pretty okay and i love them when they're so big and flary like that so that is the reason for me getting these and i hope you guys can see that and it's not too bright i'm gonna probably turn the light down a little bit but i thought these were so cute for $2.99 the price point was actually $7.99 and i just thought that these were so cute like these i thought these were so pretty um and it's hard to buy lashes online i was really impressed and i was happy that i only had to spend 2.99 so i like amazon for certain things especially because they have so much to look through and girl if you are not busy and you ain't got no friends and stuff then hunty you can sit on there for hours now moving on so this item here we're going to use we're going to go to next is also by oxley or it's also a product of oxley that was also gifted to me and i was really dumbfounded when i seen them in person because i was like yes hunties okay come through you guys so and you know what there's so many different companies popping up which is amazing like i like that especially for beauty products and especially if they're affordable and especially if you're like a huge like humongous fan of like beauty products you can definitely go to like these subscription monthly subscription shops and some of them may sell a bunch of different things but it's great when you can just find one that just caters to what you like so with that being said the product that i'm talking about the website that i'm talking about is called liveglam.com so they're a monthly beauty supply or just a monthly beauty subscription where you can choose your addiction, choose your glam. If you like to just get makeup brushes every month, then you can subscribe to just getting makeup brushes every month, which are from Morphe. If you like to do liquid lipsticks and things, then you can just subscribe to that one and you can just get liquid lipsticks every month. Or also, if you like to just do eyeshadows, you can subscribe to their eyeshadow subscription box and you can get monthly eyeshadows. If you don't want to say do the monthly thing you can also still purchase as just a regular customer of course you're going to end up paying a little bit more but it's totally totally worth it i do like the selections and plus 
the Kiss Me brand liquid lip glam liquid lipstick is so pretty. So these items were also gifted to me by Octoly. I love like the nudish colors or the very light colors. And when these were showcased on Octoly, I was like, yes, girl, yes, this is for me. This is all me. So their, their glass containers are a frosted glass, which is so pretty. And it also says Kiss Me on the front. And I do like, like their logo, just the script on it and the colors. So I do have three three colors here and this month is more or less about you know coffees okay so this one right here is the kiss a latte okay and it's a very light color pink it do have the doe foot application and let's see here this is definitely my color okay honey that color pink is so pretty. I probably would add this with something. I definitely wouldn't wear it alone. I would definitely probably add this on top of something like this color that I have on here. Now this color I thought was really unique and pretty. And this is the Glamacino, like Cappuccino Glamacino color. It looks like a grayish, kind of like very muted color of mauve. But, and it is. It, you know what? This reminds me, I can't remember what brand it was, but every time I would go on the website, the color was sold out and it was like, like $30, I think. Um, it was, I think it was $30. It wasn't, it wasn't cheap, but it was, the color was called Marshmallow and it was this color right here. Okay. Now, a lot of people may not like this color, but I, I love this color. Like I absolutely love this color. So when I seen like the pickings, like meaning the items that they had on Oxley available for review and asked if I could review this product. So it's a really easy process on Oxley. Like I said, they have amazing stuff. You get points, meaning, okay, when you first start out, I think you get like five coins. If that's what I consider points. And you get to pick five products. Now, when you first start off on Oxley, your, your store may be different from my store because I've been on Oxy for probably like three years um, and I have about nine points now but um, you get different products so like for someone that's just starting out they may only see things like Wet n Wild and L'Oreal and things like that but when you keep progressing and you, the more reviews you do and such you start getting more coins and you also start seeing more higher end products they have all type of products and the cool thing about it is they gift you the products and all you have to do is do a honest review especially if you're like a makeup junkie and you love like beauty products then they have all kind of things and the last one right here is very beautiful very beautiful it almost matches like my nail color i would say it's with like in a peach family um if you want to say but i wear this color a lot Look at that, it does match my nails. So they do dry very well and you do wanna make sure that they dry before you start smudging into them. The one that I wanna try on is the second one that I showed you, which is the Glamacino. Now, I know I look a little crazy right now. It's not as opaque as I thought it would be. And you know, guys, I am not the best with putting on any type of lipstick, okay? I'm just going to, um, yeah. I'm going to try um, this one here, which was the last one, which is very beautiful over that. Okay, so we back into the color family that I like. Okay. I do like two. I don't really like that grayish color on me at all. That made me feel like I was, um, you remember Tyrone from Dave Chappelle? I started feeling like his twin. Anybody got some spirit change? I guess it all depends on, you know, like I said, your skin complexion and also what you really like. You know, there are a lot of people that love that look, that color, and that's, you know, to each his own. But I don't really think that that color was for me. So we are going to just say no to that one and definitely yes to the first two that I showed you guys. So that was lipglam.com and they actually do have a website as well. I will link all of the information below in case you're interested. Like I said, you can do the lipsticks for monthly if you like that. You can do the eyeshadows if you like that or you can do the Morphe makeup brush. Uh, the next item that was gifted to me also by Octoly is an amazing pair of eyelashes. Okay, hunties, I love eyelashes. And and especially because I don't want to look like Kermit the Frog. Like seriously, I wear individuals and then I put on a fresh pair of individuals today. So that way I can show you guys this um, 
these lashes that I'm going to put on also over top of them, which are the strips. Now, I like to wear the individuals a lot. That's all I ever wear. Um, and lately, I don't wear them alone. I'll wear strips on top of them. But the strips will stay on my eyes for like two weeks with the individual. So I use my actual individual glue to adhere the strips to my eyes and they're perfect this is just the regular Ardell lash type and I purchased three bottles of these as a set three of these for only $11 from Amazon and this is the black one these are much bigger than the actual bottle size that you'll get at like the beauty supply store and they came with three for 11 bucks and I've had them for like a year over a year and they do last and they work and I like the black formula much better because it does hold it used to didn't hold and it used to hold and it stopped working and I went to the clear and then the clear start working so these ones the black actually works a lot better it dries a lot different from the clear and it's just like a really good um this is Ardell professional i'm not sure if it's like a different kind of hold but you can definitely go on amazon and get these next brand that i'm going to show you guys is the luxury vegan lashes that was gifted to me by oxley this is velvet 59 which are the barbies they are called barbies okay and for one these eyelashes are amazing i was been i've been waiting two weeks to get these the reason why i've been waiting to, not to, to get them but to put them on i've already had them for a minute but the reason why i waited is because i had just did my lashes and then the very next day is when these came in the mail so i wasn't about to take my eyelashes off and rip off a little bit of ones that i did have okay and i love the packaging okay pretty okay hello and oh my god i cannot wait i'm gonna put these on right now Cause that's the reason why I just have the individuals on because I'm going to put these on right now. Hey y'all, it's your girl April and we're about to put these eyelashes on. Look, girl, let me make sure my camera is focusing. Okay, honey, I'm going to need you to see these. Look at these, like, whew, these are what you call wisps wisp wisp okay beautiful okay and like i said these are the barbies by paris manning velvet 59 okay luxury vegan lashes yes. i'm gonna just see how it looks like before i put it on so since it's sticky you see that oh these look so i, I really want to wait until wear these to new york because uh, these are bomb, okay? Ooh. Now, you know what? I want to do a comparison. I'm going to do a comparison. I'm going to try one of these, the vegans, and one of these that I bought from Amazon. I love eyelashes that are big and flary. Look at that. Now, these are the Amazon ones. I hope they don't let me down. Oh, the Amazon ones are nice, okay? Look, I'm like all the... Oh, yeah, they're nice, but... Now, look at the difference. I mean, it all depends on what you're into, but these, girl, I'm into, I'm definitely into these. Look at that. I'm saying, look at that. These are freaking gorgeous. I'm about to put these on. Amazon ones are nice too. Like I said, it all depends on what you're into, but you get like a totally different look. Like with these Barbies, they, these look like Barbies, okay? For real. These lashes are like everything. Hunties. These is like giving me like, oh girl, you know you cute. Y'all's aunties. And then when you get somebody that walk by, some girl who's like giving you that look, you just be like, that's what you can do. What I did is I poured the sum of the glue right here. That's the blackness. And I used this. This is like an old applicator that I have. And I just put the glue on here and I put it right on the band, like right here. I just take it like this. Now look in this mirror. Oh, yes, hunties. Look at that. These are gorgeous.
lashes are like everything. Tati, look at these lashes. These are like definitely everything. I'm loving these. Did you hear Tati say it again? Look, I just put them on. You, I, I don't, but I can get you a pair. They, they're bomb, right? They're, they, I, they sent them to me. These are the Barbies. Vegan. No, I didn't because she was vegan for 30 days, okay? These are beautiful, right? This is definitely a winner, okay? These are the Luxury Vegan Lashes Velvet 59 Barbie, okay? Beautiful, reusable, um, suggested use, two, 20 to 25 wears, you guys, okay? Looking for luxury lashes without hurting fur babies? Look no further. Our vegan and cruelty-free lashes are just what you want and need and make any look unforgettable, unforgettable over and over again. So you guys will definitely not forget how cute I looked today, all right, when I had on my lashes. These are freaking gorgeous. I gotta take a picture, okay? So definitely check them out. If you are into lashes, they will definitely have you floored with these Barbies. Like, for real, these look like some bomb Barbie lashes. So, we are gonna go on to the Okay, next. so the next item from Octoly, which was also gifted to me, is once again another favorite company of, a company of mine. This is, cause the eyelash place is my favorite now, okay? But this company, I actually did a um, contact lens review for them. Those were also gifted to me, and I did a comparison. But this brand right here was definitely, they came through. Definitely an international website. It do come from Italy. Dicio. I think that's how you pronounce it. Um, you guys know I am the name chopper, but Dicio, Dicio, Dicio. I'm not really sure, but their contacts are like amazing. Like they look so natural and just so pretty um, that I wear my other pair still. And the colors are like beautiful that they have to choose from. You do get a book that comes with this and it just tells you the different collections that they have inside. And if you want to go outside and sunbathe, you can take this with you and you can get like the rays of light which is great as well but the CEO has a great contact lens company like I like their contacts a lot and it also comes FedEx and like I said it's, it is located in Italy they do come in this box right here and it just says attitude one day color contact lens the color that I have is the wild green okay let's come with a pair of these little contact tweezers so that way you don't have to stick your fingers all in the actual you know contact stuff and these are really good too i like these little contact um tweezers because they have rubber tips on them and they just make it a lot easier to pick up your lenses Oh, snap a -rooty. So I got something totally different this time. Okay, this is cool. So these are actually one day wear contact lenses. Oh, shoot. One day color contact lenses. So, wow, I am like shocked, shook it, okay? I actually have one, two, three, four, five, six day wears of contact lenses okay let me look at the instructions for these and see how long you can actually really wear them because it does come with information inside which is cool because you know what if you have your girlfriend with you and you guys want to go out but you both want to have like really pretty eyes you can definitely share a pair with her great for traveling with but plus if you're someone like me that forgets that you have contacts because you don't wear them every single day sometimes they will dry out so so this is just like the pamphlet that comes inside and it has all all of the different lenses attitude and such like that this is really this is a lot better for me because I have had contacts that I did like and just actually forgot all about them okay so yes these are actually one day contact lenses have no maintenance on them like myself like I said if you don't actually wear them every single day then you will forget about them like me I don't put them in all the time like every single day the ones that I do have to buy the Sawyer I'm um, the CEO because I don't go anywhere every day sometimes I'm just in the house and I'm looking like a raggedy bum so why would I just go put contact lenses on but these are for those people like myself who may forget about them and don't go and check on them 
them and make sure that they have the solution in them. I have had many issues like that where they've actually dried up. Like when I did want to go back to them, girl, they was dry. I'm not sure if you can actually reuse these, meaning reuse them the next day to each his own. I'm not going to say tell you you can. I'm not going to tell you you can't. Um, I'm pretty sure the quality of them is the same as a pair of contact lenses that you would use probably like more than one time one time but I'm just going to try it out myself that way just because I don't like to waste anything especially if I like it you do need to make sure that you shake it up it says oh, these, are these are freaking gorgeous you know something I'm gonna be honest to tell you guys um, I've worn a lot of different color contacts and when I first put them on they have my eyes kind of feeling like heavy like I'm tired and I could feel them at first and then I have to like kind of squeeze my eyes shut um, with their brand I've never done that with they don't make my eyes tired but with this one these feel like they're a little bit more lightweight than the other ones like you know what I'm saying like these are a lot lightweight like they don't these are not bothering me at all okay I don't know, I always have an issue with my left eye sometimes. I guess because my right finger, I'm right handed and my eye is right here. For me to go this way, it works a little, and it's just, even with makeup, um, even with makeup, I can do one eye better. And it seems like the eye that I can always do better, like eyeshadow, is this one. And the one that I can do better with eyeliner is this one. And I'm not sure why, but certain eyes I can do better with something else. Conties. With my lashes on and my eye contacts, look at me. Mm. These are bomb. Oh my God. I like these. They have some really, really pretty contacts. Like seriously, I really, really am enjoying this brand. Like for real. I am like tickled pink, okay, over the entire products. From the actual lashes, okay, the actual contacts, and the liquid lipstick, except for one color. I'm actually, like, amazed at, like, these lashes are, like, giving me life right now. And then with the contacts on, girl, yes, looking like a Barbie. So, you guys, you definitely want to check out DCO. They have, now that I've known, they have one day, con one day contact lenses, and you get six pair, okay? Um, six pair, you get six pair, you get a total of 12 of these, so you get six pair. Now, I'm not sure if you can stretch the wear to more than a week, I mean, a day with each one. I would definitely give this company a try. They have like some amazing contacts and they look so natural, which is great because I don't want to go outside looking like an anime or like some type of lizard. So I feel really sexy right now. Like I really feel like a freaking Barbie right now. All right. So definitely check so, them out. I did get some candles. Now I know you guys who have actually seen my um, haul for um Bath and Body Works, you probably like, girl, you didn't, why did you get more candles? I didn't purchase them. These were sent to me by Charm Candle Company, all right? So these are handcrafted candles, and they're not actually candles that I did receive, but I have the wax melts, okay? They did send me two packages of wax melts. I think it's two packages. Let me make sure and see. Actually, it's three. Okay, and I love the wax melts because I make wax melts out of my leftover candles. So these are handcrafted soy candles. Is that what is that that's what they make? And this one here is the berry bliss. You get six cubes in a per container. I think they run like ten dollars or six dollars, something like that, on the website. I will definitely post their information below. But this is berry bliss. I think it was ten dollars. It was actually ten dollars. And they do <clears throat> They do smell strong, like not in a bad way, because I get some that like from the Dollar Tree. Don't, I mean, I love the Dollar Tree, don't get me wrong, but I can't get everything from there. Um, I don't think like their wax melts or their candles smell anything like Bath and Body Works or Yankee. I'm like really particular about the candles that I use. Um, so I'm going to definitely give these a try. 
Um, but from what I'm smelling right now, these do smell very strong. You can either use one of like the electrical plug-in wax melts or you can use the ones like I like to use, which are the tea light candle with the tea light candles. I think like the ones with the tea light candles, just you can smell the wax melts a lot better. So that's the ones that I prefer to use. But if you're worried or concerned about like fire hazards and fire safety, then, you know, definitely use like the plug-in ones. But this is the Berry Bliss and it smells really pretty. Um, it doesn't smell as fruity as I would have thought it to smell and I'm not like a huge fan of fruity scents um and not that not that it's a bad thing but um I'd rather prefer like something that's calming and more like a, or a masculine cologne smell it is kind of like light and calming um it kind of smells like to me like a candy like a grape candy so it does smell good this one here is my favorite fresh cotton because it reminds me of actual like linen laundry i like i like the smell of laundry this one actually reminds me of the um febreze they have um what melting cubes also wax melts and they have one that is like fresh linen but this smells just like it but this one is my favorite because it smells like fresh laundry and i love it it reminds me so much of fresh linen um and i love that smell i love the smell of laundry and then the last one is escape and it just has like this beachy scene like this beachy scene running on the sand and stuff and it's probably gonna more or less smell like you know like the outdoors outdoors of beach and stuff and i can't really remember what this one smells like Okay, well, I don't really know what outdoors beach smells like. I don't really think it has like a smell like that, but it kind of reminds me of something that has like vanilla in it um, and such. It's a very light scent. It's sweet, and but it's not too sweet. I would probably say like this one would be my second favorite, um, but definitely fresh cotton. Um, if I had to choose between the three, I would say definitely get fresh cotton like by far this is the one that you have to get everything is handcrafted and it's called charm candle so I will leave the link below like I said they're ten dollars each um to some it might be a little bit pricey you know especially to like someone like me that's cheap but I mean like if you're into stuff and you love like the aromatherapy and just your home to smell good then give it a try you know it's soy candles um you can definitely reuse them you can relight them and things like that so i'll definitely leave it down below for you guys the next thing that i think like it's really really amazing are these these are actually my favorites i'm sorry i'm just gonna eat one right now i know you like girl i know this is not a review for them but if you love these trolley sour bike crawlers, then um, I'm saying just just thumb the video up, okay? Leave the comment below saying you love them just as much as I freaking love them. Like I absolutely love those candies. I I eat them all the time. It is one of my favorite websites in the entire world for beauty products, okay? girl let me tell y'all something i am cheap and i love makeup to death like seriously i do love makeup and i have all types of brands here in my bathroom oh, excuse me but i really don't like to spend a lot on makeup especially because if you like something so much you don't want to spend like all your money on it you know so i'm just giving you that barbie vibe right now and yeah like so i really love makeup and such and um yeah, it's like one of my favorite passions. Though I don't do it that great, um, I just absolutely love it. Um, so yeah, if you love makeup as much as I do, then you'll definitely have to check out Shop Miss A. I absolutely love them. So they did send me some new stuff. This is not the stuff that they sent me. The stuff that they sent me is actually in this basket. And I'm going to show you guys some of it because I'm going to have a separate video for them, which I've already done. But I just want to show you guys some of it because in case you guys don't like to do or watch makeup tutorials, but you like to watch me talk crap about other companies, then we here for the tea. Um, I'm just going to show you some of the products that um, they, they have just released. And because I love them so much that the stuff that they sent me, I've purchased some more of my own. Um... And it's actually like the other colors that they didn't send me and some of the other products that I didn't pick out. Um, Girl Boss is what they sent me. This is their makeup pouches. You know, everything I'm about to show you guys is a dollar for a dollar. Make me holler. Yes. Okay. 
Um, and they do have like their new line out of blushes, which is by the AOA brand that they, they have. Okay. So they do have an AOA brand and that's their brand. And it goes to all, like not all monies, but some monies do go to the Paul Paul foundation, which are for animals. And I think that's amazing. Um, and their blushes are like so pretty and radiant. Like I think you can use them for highlighters. So they did send me a bunch of their new blushes, which I was so floored with. Okay. Absolutely beautiful colors. Um, and they're only a dollar. The packaging worth alone is worth alone more than a dollar. And this is their Lumi Radiant Blush. And there's a bunch of different colors in the actual collection. I love their collection better than I love like the other dollar makeup that they sell. Like they have some really great dollar makeup, don't get me wrong, but I love their brand because it's just really, really worth it. So this is the Radiant Blush that they have out. And I'm not gonna do any swatches because I've already done it as a separate video, but I just wanted to show you some of the stuff that they have. This is just like another one, which is the Golden Apricot, okay? This is actually the highlighter, and it's called Halo Highlighter, okay? And this one is called Desire, or Desiree. I think it's called Desire. Um, and it's like a pinkish with kind of like reflex of purple in it. And then also another highlighter um, in that was this one, which is called Blissful. And I, I use this a lot, okay? I do use Blissful a lot, all right? And listen, for a dollar... You are not really going to get like good makeup. Like you'll get some things that's really worth good, worth it for a dollar. And when I say not good makeup, I don't mean this actual website. I mean like if you're going up to the Dollar Tree or something. And Dollar Tree does have some good stuff. I'm not knocking Dollar Tree, but I would rather buy makeup from, you know, Shop Miss A because their stuff is just like a lot, a lot better quality. And this also is another highlighter, which is called Sunstone, which I absolutely love too. I use this one as well. Um, so... Yeah, they do have like some really great quality um, makeup. And I'm sorry if you're not, oh, so you do see that, see? I, I told you I wasn't gonna do any swatches, but I just was retouching my makeup just a little bit for the video, you know, just retouching and stuff. Um, but so if you guys have never heard of it, I guess you guys have been sleeping under a rock about Shop Miss A, but they have like some amazing products. And I just wanted to show you some of the stuff. I'm gonna show you everything, but I'm not gonna swatch it. Okay, so those were the blushes and highlights, and that's not all of them, but you know, you'll see the separate video. Also, they have their setting powers, okay? Let's shut the front door on the setting powders. When I did the video, um, I did the hopeful face. I was kind of skeptical and scared to do the actual setting powders because I didn't want a flashback. But these daggone damn things work amazing for a dollar. They have sifters. They're a nice size for a dollar. Like, seriously, look at that. Okay, so the colors that they sent me was light on. Um, what was it called? I got the brightening and I got the softening color. Either one of them works good on me. I did not get any flashbacks and no ashiness, okay? I don't like ashiness. I like those colors so... I like that stuff so much from them. That $1 setting powder that I went and I made my own order. And I got the banana, okay? So for a dollar, you're definitely going to holler for some good cosmetics. So I'm saying... You know, you don't have to take my word for it, but you know, you should take my word for it. Then they sent me like a bunch of their different colors of their new concealer. Now this is their Wonder Cover HD Concealer. This stuff is by far the best. Now let me tell you something. You know how you love the freaking LA Girl Pro Concealer? Yeah, yeah, it's great. I like it too, okay? But I have to use it to where I have to make sure that it's dry or just damn near drying before I can blot it in. Sometimes I got to use more than one coat. With this stuff, this is full coverage. You do not have to sit around waiting for it to dry up. Make sure you hurry up and blot it in. It's full coverage. It holds all day and it's only a buck, all right? I have tried many different concealers for a dollar and trust me when I tell you they are not worth it, okay? They're not even worth 50 cents. This stuff right here though... This stuff right here, this stuff right here, they have like a nice color wheel of colors. So if you guys are wor worried about your like your skin tones, they have a nice array of different colors. They come in these nice little classy um, bottles, which alone are worth more than a dollar, okay? And like I said, I got eight of them from them that they sent me. And the one that I use a lot for like my under eye is beige. Now, I will be honest, the color smell, when you first smell it, 
Well, you know what? They don't smell bad anymore. But when I first tried to smell it, when I first got it, I didn't really care for the smell too much. You know, it was kind of like, not disturbing, but it wasn't to the point where you was like, I'm wearing this. It was good. Like, I really did like the, the, the payoff. But the smell was like, it wasn't like that great to me. But now, I don't, you know what I think it is? That I've used it. I think once you open it and you use it, it the air seeps into it, the smell dissipates because, um... There's no smell like that anymore, but I will be honest with you, when I first got it and opened it, I was not like a huge fan of the scent at all. And then they also have the Wonder Brow, okay? And I have three colors, all right? Now, I'm not like a huge fan of this stuff. I'm just going to be honest. It's a dollar. Um, It's a nice little size. You're getting it. It's a dollar. Um, I guess because I'm so used to what I'm used to, like, I like what I like. So, I mean, like, it all depends on you, your personality, your preference. Um, it is like a good consistency. Um, but at the time when I was trying to use it, I needed my brows done. So I had to tweeze them in between the video. But, um, like, it does work. It's good. But it's not like one of my favorites, okay? I do have my favorites and you guys know that, okay? Which I think makes my brows look amazing. I kept getting, like, com comments to try out their um diamond and lip diamond lip gloss the casing is so cute on these things like look at this like this is a dollar like i'm saying you girls if y'all don't want to get the makeup then that's fine i know i will be and when you see something just buy it right then don't say i'm gonna come back tomorrow because it might not be there but i was very shocked that the new colors that i wanted like the banana and such was in stock because girl hunties, I was stocking up. They also do have some sponges. And they also have one that looks kind of similar to my favorite orange sponge. It's a little bit more darker, um, bigger. I'm not like a huge fan of it. It was workable, but not like one of my faves. Then I went, like I said, and I purchased some more items. So I did get some more colors to their concealers. LA Girl can go ahead somewhere. For real. LA Girl can definitely go ahead somewhere. Also decided to get their... Um, Finishing press powders. Well, I did get a bunch of different colors. Like, I did get banana, okay, because I want to try that out just as a press powder along with a loose powder. I want to see how that works. Look at the packaging. Sleek and pretty. So, and I also did get sand, which, um, I'm not really sure if it's my color or not. Um, probably not, but, you know, I just... It's sometimes hard to buy foundation and press powder looking at a computer monitor, but if it's a dollar, you're not really going to go wrong. But I do know that almond is definitely my color, and I just got this color actually for a highlight um, underneath my eyes because sometimes, like, the banana ones do not work out for me, and they make me look ashy, so that's why I don't use, like, a lot of the banana colors, okay? I will post their links below and check out their brand. There is a link on the website that says shop the AOA brand. That's what you want to shop, hunties, the AOA brand. Shop the AOA. Shop the AOA. Shop the AOA. That's enough. But yes, you guys, definitely, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope it was not too long for you guys. You can check out octoly.com down below if you want to sign up and click the link below so that way you can sign up and do some social media, you know, reviews as you receive these gifted items. I love these lashes and contacts. I'm so Alright guys, so for this second part of the product review, I decided to show you guys a quick demonstration. So I was also gifted this box here of the Mark Daniels Professional Lush Luminous Blonde Shampoo, Conditioner, and Toner. This is a 3-in-1 system that they did send me. I've actually used this product prior. Um, I did purchase mine from Amazon, but I was also gifted this from Octoly. You guys know how I feel about Octoly. You just get wonderful, amazing gifts. Um, all they ask in return is for an honest product review on your social media. So this right here is actually a great product. The shampoo is just like any other purple shampoo. It helps to tone the brassy orange tones out of like say bleached hair. And it also um, tones like the really yellowish tones in like your blonde hair. So you would want to use the shampoo twice in one setting, meaning this wig here I have, I did bleach the knots, but the color is, you know, it's, it is a nice color, but I want it to be a little bit more toned. So I'm going to also be using it on there as well as the knots. So as for the kit, it does come with the three items and I'll just show you that real quick. Shampoo, which is in a purple bottle. 
and the first thing you want to do is you want to make sure you rinse out the product like the dye or the bleach out of the hair first and then you want to shampoo the hair with this make sure that it's lathered up and once you do that, you want to just rinse it out really quick. The first shampoo opens up the cuticles in the hair, so that way the second shampoo will definitely penetrate the cuticles and it will allow the hair to tone. Following up, you'll want to use the conditioner. Um, I do also use the conditioner. This is a really great product. I did find one of my favorite YouTubers using this product, and it does alleviate a lot of time. So that's the reason why I like to use the toners now versus using like Wella toner. It just just takes away a lot of different steps you have to do so this is the conditioner and it just prevents brassy tones and colored highlighted and natural hair so this is the purple powerful conditioner and last but not least is the leave-in conditioner toner which you just you know leave it in your hair this will also help with it just preventing the brassy tones throughout the process if you ever do wash well when you do wash your hair again you don't have to use the purple shampoo you can use this so the first thing i want to do is just rinse this bleach out Now I'm going to take the purple shampoo. And this is just going to help any brassy roots that I have or just brassy knots. And this actually smells really good. And then I'm going to put this purple shampoo on the actual hair. Now you guys probably can't tell on camera, but it is giving this color like a really pretty tone to it. It doesn't look so yellowish. And I'm going to reapply the toner excuse me, the purple shampoo. Let's rinse this out. We're gonna go ahead and use the conditioner. It's always best to follow up with the conditioner. If you don't have it, that's fine because the main thing is the purple shampoo, but the conditioner does work really well. This is going to perform its magic, so you wanna leave this in for like about two minutes. Now, it actually looks like the hair has highlights in it now versus what it did before. Prior to this, it was just like basically one flat color. But just from looking at it, um, I can see different colors of blonde, which is even better because I like that. Time to rinse the conditioner out.
going to follow it up with the leave-in toner. I'm just going to take a small amount. No. So since I have enough hair, this is also purple. And just a small amount. And I will just go ahead and brush it through just to make sure that it's through the entire hair. And that's it, you guys. So you definitely check out the Mark Daniels Professional Lush Luminous Blonde Purple Shampoo, Conditioner, and Leave-In Toner. Like I said, you can check Octoly out. They have amazing products to review. You're definitely going to want to check out Shop Miss A. All these products in here were a dollar. Like, I'm saying, if you are on a budget or you ain't on a budget, but you just love makeup, then you definitely want to check them out. If you are into candles and such, listen, hunties, then you also want to check out Charming Candle Company. But, you guys, I'm kind of happy about this review because, listen, I didn't have nothing bad to say. I mean, like I said what I had to say about the lipstick from, you know, Lip Glam. You guys know for a fact that that lipstick color was not for me. Let's just be for real. Okay? Mm-hmm. Yeah. You know it wasn't for me. But I did like the other one. So I'm very happy with my products. And now it is time for me to go because it's 10 o'clock at night and i was really honestly supposed to do something else today uh yeah so i hope you guys enjoyed this video i uh, will leave all the links below for you guys and that note stay deep and deep delicious i love you guys and i'll see you in a soon to come video okay so i'll get you another one go clean up don't forget about your microphone always forgetting that you walk off you'll be like, I'm glad.